hiding from his sister, Jean. He wants Jean to see him. Jean doesn't see him. She is busy with her doll clothes. She leaves them to dry in the sun. Jean tells Nancy Jane her pay be good. Jean is all dressed up, for she is expecting a visitor. Betty, her friend, very soon. She must get ready. But here is Frank again. Why is he running? Oh, he sees Betty coming. Betty and her doll Beatrice. Jean welcomes her friend Betty. She thinks Beatrice, Betty's doll, would like to play with Nancy Jane. But who is this running behind the tree? Why, it's Frank again. Why is he listening so closely? He hears Betty say, Beatrice burned her finger yesterday. I have been worried about my dolly too, says Jean. Do you see any red spots on her? I think she's getting measles. Measles? Red spots, says Frank. That gives me an idea. Oh, but look. Nancy Jane is sleepy. It's time for her nap, Jean says. But first, she must have her milk. Beatrice is sleepy, too. A bottle of milk for Beatrice. A bottle of milk for Nancy Jane. And so to the afternoon nap in the warm sunshine. Nancy and Beatrice, side by side, tuck safely in bed for a nice, long afternoon nap. and lunch together. Do you take cream in your tea, asks Jean. Oh, yes, thank you, Betty answers. It's very good. And you? No, I take lemon, Jean replies. And so Jean and her friend Betty are having a quiet lunch together while their dollies sleep. But there is Frank again. Where is he going? He is over by the doll. Why is he smiling to himself? What does he have? He has a box of crayons. He takes out the red crayon. Now what is he doing? Oh, look, he is making red marks on Nancy Jane's face. Jean, look. Look at what Frank is doing. But Jean doesn't see him. Red marks, the measles. Frank has given Nancy Jane the measles. Look, Jean, before Frank goes away. But Jean doesn't see him. Poor Nancy Jane. She really has the measles now. But when will Jean see what Frank has done? Will Jean see now? Look, Jean. Look at Dolly's face. And she does. Nancy Jane, what has happened to you? You really caught the measles. What shall I do, asks Jean. I'll call Mother. Mother, come here, please. But who is that behind the fence? Yes, it's Frank. Look, Mother, says Jean, Nancy Jane has the measles. Measles, hmm, I tell Jean. Someone has painted the measles on Nancy Jane's face, and there he is. It's Frank. He looks for a place to hide. Not in here, Frank. After him, Betty. After him, Jean. Here he comes, right through the clothes on the line. Here he comes again. What fun, what fun everyone is having. But where is Frank now? Where is he hiding? There is a shadow. After him. After him, everyone. But we can't find him. Where is he? There he is. There is Frank's shadow. Now we have him at last. Give up by paper and a crayon, a red crayon. Frank wants to know what is going on, too. But you just get back to work, Frank. You'll know in just a minute. 
There, Jane is all finished. What does she have? It's a sign. Laughs and Frank joins in. <laughs> 